Well, I went out there and I took a picture facing the eastern sky with the sun rising. And I was able to pick something up and I was able to see what was to the left of the, um, I'm gonna turn this around, the left of this. And look, we've got more things right here. More of this and more ships. There's that uh, little frequency thing right there also. I'm gonna turn up this volume. Well, it, okay, it's a, there's that frequency thing right there. Yeah, but these ships, they're in like a different formation. They're all over the place, and there really is so many of them. And we can see that they are clearly ships. They got this black stuff on them, but I thought that was pretty neat to see more of these things right here on the side of this object, whatever this is, this egg shape and all these ships. This was the best photo that I had that had the most detail in it, but I've posted these on my timeline and um, I tried to get a picture of all the ships that were around it and stuff. And there are, there's gobs of ships out there. And Gina, how are you catching these? I don't know. I, there is no human explanation, okay? I could be tapping into another realm, dimension, or perhaps whatever's out there I'm meant to catch on here for to share with people, okay? I don't know what we're looking at, but it definitely is something that we don't see every day, okay? I don't even know if you see these in sci-fi things, but there's all these objects out there. Yeah, there's another one of those um, double-decker things, whatever they are, ships, but look at them. They're all over the place. And if I, if I get a photo before I leave and go to work, and maybe I can work on it, if maybe I can get some more things, but yeah, these are all over the place. The photos are on my timeline. And um, these are different objects to the side of the sphere, or whatever it is. I wanted, I knew there was something over there. I just wanted to see what was on the other side. It's like we're looking at in a, a whole new universe or something. It's, it's so strange. And I know people are commenting, but I'm not looking at the comment because I'm trying to concentrate on what I'm showing you before people, you know. Some people can't zoom up that well, and this tends to be able to get you a closer view of what we're looking at up there in the skies. These things are out there, or I would not be catching them. We may not be to see them right now with our naked eye, but I'm sure we will eventually see these things, and they are on my timeline, these photos, and, um, yeah, that's a... These are just all over there. And it's kind of dark and gloomy to look at these things, but they're there. But look at that. There's one down there. And look at these ships. They're clearly ships. And there's another frequency thing. That's what someone called them. And, um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I like to do infrared, but you know what? This has a lot more excitement to it, and there's not much to get in infrared today. This is cloudy and overcast, but look at those frequency symbols. Whatever those things are, I don't know what they are. Now, yeah, this is below it. Just look at them. This is all from one picture, and I've included the original photo on here. I really have. They're just everywhere and they appear to be the same type these right here the, the, these blacks and white I think they're up there in the clouds at times too I really do but I think that's really nice they'd be able to capture that again because you know we didn't know and there's something like that egg shaped thing and you can see there's little ships around there also and up there and all around it but this is like the original image right here. 
Yeah, I don't know. It really is like an, another universe we're looking at or something. But yeah, you can see all these objects and stuff. And I will try to, if I can, which I did, to like darken certain areas to bring out those objects better. Okay, but yeah, there's that thing again. I don't know what type of ship this is that where it like goes together like that, okay? But okay, I don't really like to make long videos, okay? And I don't know how long I've been talking. <laughs> yeah, but that's pretty neat. I think it is pretty neat seeing those things because it's exciting, but then in a way, you know, it could be a little scary. But you know, at least you're seeing what's out there right now. And you know, you can let it sink in and come to terms with what's out there. And hopefully, it'll help you along, okay? We're going to flip this around. But thank you for coming to my Facebook page, for being my friend. I'm sorry I cannot accept any more friend requests. There may be that instant where I may accept a friend request but as of now um it's probably around 800 now and there's way too many to go through and when i just accept certain people i don't know who i'm accepting and that's when i get these bad comments that i get on here anyway but you know what it's not going to stop me okay i'm still going to take pictures and i'm just tune them out you know this is this is bigger than them okay i am beyond that all right let's flip this around and we're going to end it right there. But this is what I caught this morning facing the eastern sky with the sun. All I could see is it was the sun in the sky with the clouds. But I just turned on my flash. I took the picture and um, went through it. And this is what happened. Okay. Yes.